So just before the video starts, um, I've you'll hear me talk about catching a fish at the um, Hini Maya, and um, unfortunately that was the best fish of the the whole trip. And um, I don't know how, but my GoPro seemed to not have recorded it or saved it. I've seen it on my GoPro, and now it's just disappeared. So um, I'm slightly upset because it was about a four pound rainbow. I'll um, insert a video. Oh, not a video, sorry, a um, photo of it just up here. Um, it was a really nice fish, but I thought I'd just upload this video. There's a couple fish caught in it. I, um, I'm uploading this video because it's my um, view on the Tongarero uh, Canal. I also um, go fishing with the Mayor of Turangi, or the Worm Expert, or um, others may call him the dude that says morning all. Andrew here from Sporting Life Fishing Outfitters Turangi. Uh, and he forgets the date most of the time, but um, no. Nah. <laughs> um, but yeah, I go fishing with him, and it was really cool. We got up a little taupo trip, so um, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy. Um, sorry I missed that footage, and yeah, enjoy the video. Yeah, there's fish everywhere. Yo, so. Just at the bridge pool, the guys are already down there. But um, the reason I'm here is to check out the controversial Tudung Canal. Now, the way I'm going to judge this is if I flip and catch fish, because there used to be a little channel that ran to the left hand side when you're walking down, and that used to be my honey hole. I swear to God, I used to catch so many fish, like I would have caught over 50 fish in that that little hole so I'm a bit pissed off so I'm on the pissed off team at the moment but we're gonna go down there we're gonna fish it the water is absolutely murky it's horrible so there's gonna be um, there's gonna be oh okay just had a good strike so uh, this is where I judge it and I'll let you know my opinion later on um, so yeah she's fair howling down now but um, yeah, so I'm on the Tongariro Canal, as they call it, but um, yeah, not convinced. No. Um, looks very fishable. It's, um, there's a couple of nice seams just in there that um, I just uh, streamed with a, I tried a um, pink rabbit fly because it's quite dirty and I thought maybe something a bit flashy might get a bow to hit, but apparently not. And I also tried a quite a big olive, olive woolly bugger and no, I didn't even get a bump so pretty disappointed but um, yeah this is what she looks like as I say not 100% convinced I'm going to fish the bottom end now I fish all the top end up there I'm gonna go down there and see if I can catch a fish. Hopefully I do. We've only got one for the day between all three of us. It's a pretty visible effort. Mind you, the tong is really discolored. It's stunned to drop now after the recreational flood. Also, I think there was a digger working in here, but that was down that way. So it shouldn't affect that, but yeah, I think this rain is gonna muck us up. Yeah, tomorrow not really expecting much fishing, really. Which is disappointing. I think tonight's gonna fair set in. And um, yeah, it'd be quite disappointing, but hopefully not. Hopefully I can get a video out for you fellas. Um, that'd be great. That'd be pretty. Yeah, so um, you don't wanna keep swinging some flies. So, you may be thinking, this is a bit small for the Tongariro, isn't it? It's because we're not on the Tongariro. Um, I'm here with Andrew from Sporting Life Fishing Outfitters Tudung. And, um, yeah, he's taken us out. 
and on a river, I have no idea what the, the name of it is. I don't think you'd want me to say the name anyway, because it's uh, quite an unpressured water, I think. So, But yeah, anyway, we're, we're out here doing the biz. Um, so there's myself, Andrew, Gabe and Kane. Um, yeah, it's a beautiful river. I mean, look at it. It's stunning. It's got some there's deep pools and little runs. And, I'm sure there'll be a few fish around so yeah a bit of a slight change in plans but I think Andrew knows what he's talking about so we're gonna follow him it's a bit of a car ride in there's a bit of a bit of a hole and it's a bit deep my car's only on well, my truck's only two-wheel drive so yeah but let's carry on here's a bit of b-roll of the river Nice fish, that one. Yeah, I'm still right in the shit up there, eh? Yeah. Right up in that shit with a few sitting up there. Nice. Nice fish. Oh, hey. <laughs> Don't hold that. Oh. That's a beauty fish, mate. Ah! The black, it's the black bow, isn't it? Spawning, Spawning glow bug. Yeah. <laughs> it's not happy. Not at all. Got him. Huh? How heavy you reckon? Oh, uh, two pounds. I'm coming down now with his thoughts for driving. He just found me. I know, yeah, he was like, oh, I heard my head. Right on that bomb. <laughs> Yoza. Overall, it was a good trip for myself. Um, the boys had a bit of a hard time, but um, that's all right. There's always uh, next weekend. So um, yeah, thanks. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that little bell icon because um, if you don't, then you miss when I upload. And I'm trying to make it more regular. A, a Kane. Yeah. Yeah. So um, yeah, thanks. Thank you all for watching. Thanks to Andrew for taking us to his um, little hidey hole spot. It was a fucking wicked spot. Although it was pretty tough fishing, um, yeah, we've got a, got a couple nice ones, so, and for you guys to enjoy, so if you enjoyed it, make sure you leave that thumbs up, and uh, make sure you comment down below something, anything, and um, yeah, so cheers guys, and I'll catch you later.